Hey guys, happy 2020 and we are back with our Fit Monday videos. I decided to run today before my workout. I do it often. Uh, if you don't like to run, you can always do fast walking. And then I'm going to stretch and start our great after holiday workout. After Christmas and days off, it will be very smart to do a full body workout. And now I'm just uh, warming up my arms because we're going to start with our upper body. Okay, our first exercise is going to be elevated push-up. Uh, normally you will do it from your knee or just a regular push-up, but this one is uh, easier. So you will need your couch, chair, bench, anything. And try to do five to eight push-ups. Make sure your elbows are looking back, not on the side. You should keep your core straight and do not arch your back. Second exercise is going to be a reverse push-up. Uh, this is great exercise for your triceps, especially for women. So we're gonna do uh, 10 push-ups and if you can't then do five to eight push-ups and again make sure you watch your elbows they should look back not on a side and third exercise going to be plank uh, try to do 30 to 40 seconds if you can uh, and your entire body will work here and after you're done with the plank uh, you want to repeat all of these exercises for two more sets so three sets total now we're going to tone our lower body. So let's start with the squats, um, 10 reps. Make sure your knee don't go past your toes and if it's too easy for you, then you should add weight. Second exercise is going to be reverse lunges and then you're gonna do a knee kick on the end. This exercise is really great for your glutes uh, and let's do 10 reps for each leg. And our third last exercise is going to be Bulgarian split lunge. And from all of the lunges, uh, this one is most effective one. It's gonna lift your butt and make it round. You wanna do 10 repetition for each leg and same thing here, you wanna watch your knee. And if you don't feel your glutes here, make sure you adjust your form. Don't continue doing it. And now we're going to repeat everything for two more sets. So we're gonna have three sets total just like our upper body. And remember, anytime you do lower body workout, your abs working as well. Now it's time for breakfast. I thought I'll film for you guys. Uh, you can have this breakfast before or after workout, however you feel. Anyway, I wanna show you a recipe for a healthy oatmeal. Uh, I do old fashioned, so I have to boil my water or milk. If you don't have time, you can get quick oats, but I recommend get uh, regular oats without any flavor. And we're gonna make it delicious. I'll show you. Uh, step by step for oatmeal i usually use almond milk because it stays better than if you just boil water uh, this one is almost out so i have another one i use one without uh, sweetener it stays amazing so for our recipe you're going to need almond milk or water honey uh, oats chia seeds coconut flakes and uh, cinnamon if you like it uh, first i'm going to boil one cup of almond milk or one cup of water if you use milk, make sure you watch it because sometimes I literally turn around for one second and before you know it, it's all over my stove. So second you see it start boiling, you wanna lower your temperature and add oats right away and mix it all together. Then you're going to boil it for up to five minutes. Make sure it's on a medium heat. Okay, so uh, I boil my oatmeal for five minutes, then I turn off the heat and let it stand for a couple more minutes. First thing I'll do is add honey. I don't add any sugar, so honey will be really nice. And then I'll add uh, chia seeds. Chia seeds full of fiber and protein, so I'll recommend add it to your salads, uh, oatmeals. 
Then I'm going to add this uh, coconut flakes. They really taste good on oatmeal. And now on the end, I'll add a little bit of cinnamon. After I mix it all up, I add some blueberries or strawberries, whatever you have in your fridge, and your breakfast is ready to go. You can also add hard-boiled egg. It will be really good for extra protein. And for my supplements, I usually take flaxseed oil and multivitamin. Uh, we'll talk about it later in different videos, but that's what I'll take uh, this morning. And I hope you guys enjoy this video and see you next time.